Hello, and welcome back to more Sims 4. Ah, it rhymes. Um, yeah, so I'm recording kind of shorter sessions this week, but lots of them. So um, there should be the same amount of videos, but uh, I don't know. They're going to be broken up a little bit. Um, you, you shouldn't notice on your end. It's just been a busy week for me. I've got a play I'm in, and my I had a sore throat at the weekend. Still not completely better, but it ah, it's getting there. Um, I'm in a play. I've got so much going on. But I have to get my sims done. I noticed last week, just as I was saving, that putting in the new bedroom seems to have messed up the wallpaper out here. And I have to do this individually, one bit at a time. Because, I don't know, wallpaper is horribly, horribly bugged. Uh, oh wait, it kind of matches the interior though, so... Oh, it doesn't. It's a slightly different brick pattern. Oh... How did they do that? Well, the inside is wallpaper with a picture of bricks on it, obviously. But uh, that's the secret. Right, Scooter, what's going on? Someone's thinking of smelly shoes. Oh, it's Connor the Sixth. She's always on about those smelly shoes. I don't, I don't know what it is. It's just it's her obsession. She's got ages to work, so I don't care about her very much. Connor the Seventh is in bed. <clears throat> Lazing about. Um, which... I don't know. I don't think she should be doing right now. No, she should. Look, I'll, I'll just let her f charge up her energy a little bit. But, um... No, too much rest makes, uh... Teenagers... Go crazy. What are her traits again? She's an active goofball. Oh, of course, yeah. And she wants to be a painter. Um... Well, we have the painting set. But I don't think she's going to be a painter. Because... She's instead destined for greater things, like opening the hatch and seeing what's inside. Oh my god, I only just noticed these weird glowing cracks around it. Oh wow, maybe there is something in here. Look, down there, what's that? Some kind of weird colour changey rock. Were they a bit there before? I don't remember seeing them before. This is getting very mysterious now. Oh, I wonder are there like magnets and stuff down there? Cool things like that. Magnets are cool, aren't they? Just of all of all the forces that make up the universe, I think magnetism is my favourite one. It's just mental. Um, <laughs> and metal. <laughs> okay, someone's got to fix these taps, and I think it's Apollella's job. She's full time servant now. Well, she she's also like a. Oh no! Wait! 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 Apollella! No. This is a job for Connor the Seventh. I keep forgetting this, but Connor the Seventh is actually our um, resident handiness person for the next, uh, well, for the next rest of her life. Until she gets her handiness skill up to level 10 and can break open the mystery hatch. I'm just so intrigued. Um, yeah, go on. Keep fixing. Keep fixing. She's pausing in between. I don't... I, no, she, need, she needs to work on her work ethic. She just needs to keep going. Get a good rhythm going. Like, just fix each tap with a single twist of the spanner. Even if it doesn't require a spanner. Even if, like, I don't know, the porcelain bowl is broken. You just, just twist the spanner over it. It'll be fine. If it doesn't fix it, it'll just break it even more. Then you can buy a new one and maybe claim insurance or something. Brilliant. All clean. Um, she needs to pee. She also needs to have fun again. Does she have her homework done? She does. Okay. Things aren't as dire as they could be. So she can go down and channel surf, maybe. Um, Apollella has a lot of rubbish to clean up. An awful lot of rubbish. And floors to mop. And just just generally a lot of stuff to do. Go on, Apollella. Get to it. Ah, there she goes. Finally, doing her job. Um... Oh look, one person's gathering up the dirty dishes and it's one of the ghosts. And I don't think he's even properly cleaning them. Oh, look, Connor the Sixth is going to do it. Is she going to do the dishes? Because no one's done the dishes in years. They've been bugged. Oh, she's bringing them over there. Why are you leaving them there? No, 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 no. Wash dishes. Wash the dishes. Come on, come on. You can, you can do the dishes with these. She's neat. She should enjoy this. Oh... 
Oh, oh, she's collecting more. This is interesting. I'm actually so excited about this to see if she'll actually do it. If the bug has fixed its... No. No. Let's see what happens if I tell her to clean up again, though. Is she going to find more dishes or just put them back down? No, she's done. She's done. Okay, that's as close as we're going to get. Um, I'll just do them myself, then. Connor the Seventh, what are you doing here? Um, weren't you meant to be watching TV? Okay, she's she's hungry. Let's get her a snack. I thought she was cooking something, but apparently not. Um, she can just have a quick yogurt. School is in a few minutes. You know, we can't waste time cooking things. Throwing her valuable points into cooking when she could should be throwing her valuable points into handiness. Look at this. Annabelle Harper is really, really focused. Oh no, she's uncomfortable. It didn't last. Now someone tells me apparently I can make The Sims um, focused if I use the coffee machine to make them black tea. I can't make it at the moment. But maybe I need a better coffee machine. Let's see what, what kinds we have. There should be a few different ones available, I'm sure. Um, miscellaneous? Miscellaneous? No. Uh, what's this? Oh, wow. It's a big rocky bin. That's kind of nice. Uh, oh, here we go. The Schmapple Coffee. Oh, well, that looks like... Oh, Tea Magic Personal Brewer. Brew all your favourite teas. Oh, and a Cupcake Factory. There's the Cupcake Factory. Gah. And did that say it's unbreakable? It is. Okay. I didn't... I couldn't find the Cupcake Factory earlier when I needed it. But uh, there it is. Now, if only we had a chef. Okay, there's where the tea machine can go, over there. I don't know why they need a tea machine. Don't they just put bags in the pot? This is their old teapot. It's obsolete now. It just looks very sad. It's been put into retirement. Um, so let's get you focused for school. Brew a pot of pitch black tea. Tea, pitch black, hot. Um... There she goes. It doesn't look black. It looks kind of reddish brown. But let's see what it does. Should put her in a focused uh, mood that'll last for four hours. Oh, there we go. Look, a little teapot icon. Perfect. And it's school time. Oh, great. Well, if she doesn't get an A today, she's never going to get an A. Um, well, yeah, she's got a few days left. Oh my god, Appalella, why aren't you in school? Oh, she's still not going to school. What What are you doing? School. Go. Go, run, run, quickly. Oh my god, that girl. What'll you do with her? Well, she's off to school anyway, she's not my problem. Connor the seventh is the, or Connor the sixth is the only one at home now. Um... And she's got three days off. You see, this is an ideal situation if there's um, a lot of sims. If, if, sorry, if you've got a, a lot of work coming up that you need to do so that your sims can train and stuff. But no, she's just got free time. So she's just going to make some BLTs, I guess. Resume the family tradition. It's been a few years since they've had a good BLT in this house. They've all been distracted with their pancakes and their uh, strawberry cake. And all the other kinds of cake. And their chicken noodles and stuff. No, we're going back to basics here. Good old BLT. Big unit test is coming up for Appalella, whatever. Um, oh, cooking level 6 already. Wow. Connor the 6th is actually really flying along. She's learning a lot. Can I put these in the fridge or something? I don't know what, I, what to do with them. I guess we can clean them up. But I can't just drag them into the bin or anything. No. Okay, she can have her dinner, and then I think it's time to do a bit of a workout. Um, some more punching. Practice for her fighting, for fight club. Or, as uh, most people would call it, a stroll down the street. Oh no! That's broken as well. Okay, well, look. Once Connor the sixth or Connor the seventh comes back from school, she can fix everything up. I keep mixing up their numbers. I don't know what's going on. It's just there's so many Connors. They've all just flown past my eyes. If 
it's insane to think Connor the fourth is Connor the sixth's grandmother and um I don't know Connor the fourth seems like ages ago now I can't imagine them ha inhabiting the same house they just seem so different as people um I wonder is blue still alive and red and all the other uh, jokers from that generation they're probably in this house somewhere if they're anywhere this is where they all ended up living but if I try to look inside the house disappears it's a ghost house Whoa. which would be spookier if we didn't have a ghost in our own house you know um, they're a little bit mundane get out of that bed you that's not your bed Look, Connor the Seventh has come in, or Connor the Sixth has come in to tell her off, and rightly so. You don't just sleep in the wrong bed. What's that music? It sounded important. Is, is Appalella dead or something? No, she's okay. She's just pretending to have a needs failure. Anastasia's home from work. Is she getting promoted? Any hope of a promotion now? She's doing okay. Um, I'll get her to create her daily paintings and maybe. Maybe we'll see after that. You better go have a BLT. A book and lettuce and tomato sandwich. Because she's a ghost. Um, I forget what she even looked like when she was alive. You know what we should really do to mess her up? We should get her like some elixir of life or something and bring her back from the dead and she won't know what's going on she'll suddenly be mortal again and um susceptible to you know all kinds of pain and everyone she knew and loved in her life will be long gone they'll all be dead or have moved on with their life they'll mostly be dead though because i think she died here during the time of connor the second so yeah th there's not many left from her time look at this painting it's amazing Pigs in a tree. Perfect. Sell it to the gallery. I demand it of you. Oh, got a good bit of money for that one. Uh, let's do another large surrealist painting. Oh, she needs to pee. Hang on. Hang on. Again? We fixed those like five minutes ago. Oh my god. These ghosts, they're just... Oh. They're, they're a pest. Those pesky undead spirits oh my god and Connor the seventh isn't even in bed like she's supposed to be and someone saw her peeing oh no she peed herself oh okay oh she didn't make it to the toilet on time why didn't you just go in the bath while you were there I admittedly that's disgusting but it's less disgusting than stepping out of the bath and peeing all over yourself just stand up before you get out of the bath let loose and then drain it down the plug hole not that I'd ever do that. That's actually disgusting. Um, but she's a sim. They don't have to worry about the same hygiene concerns as we mortals do. Um, grab a serving of the old BLTs. See what you think of them. Well. Ah, oh, there she goes. She was hesitant before tasting and before taking that first bite because they're a very well crafted sandwich she was admiring the um, workmanship the artistic talent that went into laying layering the bread correctly um, placing the tomato between the lettuce and bacon so it wasn't in direct contact with the bread causing soakage I mean Connor the Sixth is a professional at making sandwiches she may be a bit of a jerk she may dress up like something out of uh, an underground porn film but when it comes to BLTs my god there's no one better uh, now what else did we need to fix sorry I know you need to go back to bed Connor the 7th but some ghosts have broken everything and I need you to fix it first you're our handyman handy woman handy person Andy Andy because Andy can be a gender neutral name okay it's more of a boy's name but there's that actress Andy McDowell and she's not a boy as far as I know so um, yeah I guess it purely because she exists it's a it can be a unisex name although oh, 
Bloody hell, Sharon, get out of there. Sharon's been such a pain now. She used to be so helpful back when she was alive. But in death, she just lives to torment us. No, we'll have our revenge someday. Oh yes, Sharon, your days are numbered. Well, we can actually, like, probably check if we added her to the family. Like, Anastasia's got 254 of them. It's amazing. She's on day 255 and feeling fine. Uh, she never resumed the painting I told her to resume. Because she doesn't care what I tell her to do, apparently. Here we go. Oh, she's painting the big orange sperm again. She has an obsession with that. I don't know why. Is it orange because it's uncomfortable? I, I'm guessing so. I'd be pretty uncomfortable if some ghost kept painting pictures of me. Um, oh, are the ghosts doing the dishes? That's good. Why are you cleaning up? Oh, okay. I guess this is uh, Connor the Seventh neat personality shining through. When I leave her autonomous, she isn't evil. She's just really, really clean. She just tidies up the place loads. and But not very well. Like, she moved that glass a couple of inches. So, I don't know. Feng Shui or something. Um, sorry, that noise was my controller dropping off the top of my computer. Two seconds. I've picked it up. Crisis averted. Um, oh, now she's running back in. Oh, what's she doing? Hiding from everyone. She's embarrassed from having an awkward conversation with a ghost. And she runs into the same ghost in her own bed. Oh my god, that is actually really awkward. Um, Anastasia, how's the painting going? Sell it to the gallery. Don't just leave it there. Sell it and start your next one. Oh, she can't. She's tense. Oh no, she's confident now. Okay. Um. Another large surrealist. Thank you very much. Actually, I'll let her take a break for a little bit. Because look, she's miserable. She needs to go down and uh, channel surf for a little while. Oh my god, there's a ghost in the TV. It's not funny anymore, guys. Just stop it. Stop! You're ruining it for everyone! We're trying to watch The Walking Dead, but the screen is shaking all over the place. Oh, who's that? That's Abby. Abby's still around as a ghost. I haven't seen her in years. Ultra rough. Ultra dry. What? What the hell was that for? Why did I write that? Oh my god, this is going to be something where I rewatch the videos and it makes perfect sense, but out of context, that just seems... What? What is here? Arise, Lord Vader. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, the rest of them all make sense. Died on Christmas Day like a reverse Jesus. Like the Fonz, but cooler. Boldly went where no one went before. Yeah, these are all okay. Then we get up to the current generations. Immortal, you said... And shine on, gentle bear. Yeah, Trip down memory lane. There's no paintings of Sims in this game. So, you know, I guess the gravestones are all we have to remember them by. Which is really sad. It makes me cry inside. I'm going to have to repair that bath. Look at it. It's a disgrace. Um, And watch some TV. Come channel surf. Look, there's... Apolella's watching already. Let's just change the channel on her. You go for it, Connor the Seventh. Oh yeah. yeah. To the exact same channel. I guess they've tuned it in twice because it's an old-fashioned TV. Or maybe they have one of those satellite things like Freeview and they get like five versions of the same channel. They get like um, Action Channel and then Action Channel Wales and then Action Channel Northwest Midlands and Action Channel Ireland and Action Channel Northern Ireland. And uh, Action Channel HD plus 2 minus 3 plus the square root of pi. It's crazy. There's just so many versions of everything. And they don't have a handy button to merge them all into one or anything because there's slight programming differences. It's, it's just an, un an unusual uh, situation. It's, ver it's very hard to keep track. So anyway, yeah, like I was saying, I'm going to be recording kind of brief sessions this week in bursts where I have a few minutes here and there because my voice goes if I talk for too long and I'm just swamped. 
but you should get a video every night anyway. So I'm going to wrap up this one here, and I guess I'll see you next time. Goodbye.